can you do this algebra one problem? So the problem says, what is the axis of symmetry? So we're given a parabola, which is just a curved graph like this, and we want to find its axis of symmetry. So the axis of symmetry is just some line that we can draw down the middle of this parabola, and it's going to divide it in half, kind of like a mirror. So if I were to draw a line right down the middle of this parabola to make it symmetrical, that would be our axis of symmetry. Okay. Now, the way that we write our axis of symmetry is we look at the x value, which in this case is one, two, so that's positive two. And because that's positive two on the x axis, that means that our equation for our axis of symmetry would be x equals positive two. And that would be the answer to the question. Now, just a couple more things you might need to know about parabolas. So usually if you see a parabola like this, that means that we have x squared somewhere in the equation, okay? That means if we found the actual equation for this parabola itself, there would be an x squared somewhere in it. Now, another important piece of information we can find is called the vertex, which in this case is right here, okay? So the vertex is always the maximum or the minimum point on a parabola. In this case, it's the minimum because it's the lowest point on the graph, right? So that point, the vertex, is at positive two for the x value, which we already said, but its y value is one half. So that means that the vertex would be positive two comma one half or 0 0.5, okay? So notice that the vertex and our equation for the axis of symmetry both have an x value of two. So that's just a pattern that you'll pick up on as you learn more algebra. If you like this video and wanna see more, hit that follow button, like this video, and leave me a comment and let me know what kind of videos do you wanna see in the future. Until next time.